Next item, Mr. Mayor, is a or is consideration to approve a conditional use permit for Brahms location for a Brahms location with a drive-through property located at 2505 and 2515 Prince Street and 963 Ferris Road. And uh, Chris, you're still standing there. I'm thinking you're wanting to talk about this. <laughs> yes, sir. You like Brahms or are you just wanting to talk about this? I'm excited about this project. <laughs> <so>. <laughs> um, Me too. I'm excited about it. So we have a conditional use uh, request to allow an eating place with drive-through services and food store in an 01 zoning district for properly, property located at 2505 and 2515 Prince Street and 963 Ferris Road. As conditioned, the negative impact to adjacent properties will be mitigated through the use of screening and landscaping, and the site will be subject to the commercial development standards in accordance with Article 10 of the Zoning Code. Staff recommends approval of the conditional use permit with the provided 13 conditions of approval. Among those 13 conditions includes operating hours are limited to 5 a.m. to 12 a.m. That would be condition one. Um, it's not limited to these conditions. So I, I don't, uh, condition number four is the development of the site is still subject to the site development review in accordance to Article 10. Uh, part, a portion of item five states that the director of planning and development may require additional screening uh, along adjacent residential areas to reduce the impact of the proposed use. And item 11 states that a conditional use permit shall expire if the, if, if the use ceases for a consecutive period of greater than 18 months uh, to accommodate Brahms identified construction schedule. Um, I have also requested that the Director of Planning and Development shall be authorized herein to grant an extension of no more than 90 days beyond said 18 months period to accommodate the applicant's identified construction and engineering timeline if necessary. Make a motion for the um, conditional use permit with the 13 conditions. Second. Second. Have a motion and a second to approve this conditional use permit for Brahms ice cream. Any further discussion? Mr. Garrett. Well, hold on. Yes, sir. <clears throat> Any further public comment? I'm sorry, I thought I did that. You? Any further comment from anyone in the in the crowd? We do have representatives from Brahms uh, present if they wanted to come forward. Would y'all like to hear from them? Council to request. They want to. I mean, <clears throat> Frank looks like he wants to get. I do. I, mean, I, I do have a question. <laughs> well, I'll let him talk first. <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't have much to say. It's just a little bit. Really. <laughs> <laughs> you see what I was trying to do, David? No, I know, know y'all tried to skip my part, did you? Frank Shaw, 1315 Main Street, Conway, Arkansas, for Brahms. And this is Cody Foran from Oklahoma City and Helen Passion from Arlington. They've come in just for the meeting tonight, so I want to introduce you to them. They're going to be good neighbors and, and good partners in our city. So we're here just to say we're for it. This is a great place for ice cream. I'll limit it to that. They shall have questions. Thank you, Theo. Did you hear that, Theo? You limited yourself. That's the best I could do. Would anyone else like to speak for or against this proposal, this resolution? Okay, hey, Council, back to you. I do have a question. Yes, sir. For, yeah, for, uh, for, like, for Chris. Cody? No. Chris? Okay. Wait, wait. Paxton? Yeah. Okay. This, this is excellent, but I do have one concern about northbound traffic on Ferris turning left. We have room to put a turn lane or anything that'll help alleviate some of that? Uh, Council member, we do still have this going through the site development review at this time. That's something I can bring up with the city engineer through that process. Um, we, we have several items that we're still looking at. It has not been approved for site development review at this time, but I can definitely bring okay, that we'll up to the staff. That on the radar. Sure. And I may ask a question. When are we up on planning commission, Chris? Is it the 18th to come back for site development review? The site development review has uh, has an exception. The exception will be um, contingent on the appeal of uh, the exception approval from the planning director. So at this time, it's not scheduled, and we're still waiting on the the, uh, the appeal process. Okay, so we'll be we'll be back in some capacity in front of the planning commission, maybe the council. But for now, we've taken a really necessary step. We're really pleased to be here, and thank you for your time. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Anything else, Council? Mr. Garrett. All in favor, say aye. 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 All opposed. Passes seven 
to zero.